Hello and what is going on guys, Tomcat here, and today we are back for another episode of our Forza Horizon 4 Let's Play. Now, for some reason, we are in uh, Alex Choi's M2, or at least as close as you can get to Alex Choi's M2 in Horizon 4, because you can't really space the wheels properly on the M2, and you can't put the wide body kit on the M2, so unfortunately, this is about as close as you can get, but... Um, it's closer than, it's closer than, it's closer than nothing, and regardless of what your, whatever your opinions are of, of Alex Troy, I, I like his M2. I think it's a really cool build, and a lot of people, a lot of people got onto him for the, the fender color, which I can understand why they would. I mean, I get it. I get why a lot of people don't like the gray fenders. I mean, even he himself said that they're going to be changing the color again and going to, like, carbon black or something, but to be honest, like... I don't know. I think the uh, I think the gray fenders look cool. I think they look, they're an interesting contrast to the yellow, and it's it's different. You know what I mean? It's 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 not classically correct, if you know what I mean. But it's still different, and I think it's cool because of the fact that it's different. But I'm just going around discovering some roads right now. 509 out of 531. We're almost there. Like we're really really close. Should that be as uh, 510? Oh, hello, Influence Board. Grab you real quick. I wonder, I mean, I feel like in this episode, we could probably finish all of the roads, or at least come extremely close to finishing the roads. Let's see. A lot of them are probably dirt, so I don't know why we're in an M2. A lot of the roads we, we have to finish are probably dirt, because which is making the M2 maybe not the most brilliant choice for this particular task, but, I mean, hey, it's, it's not a bad car, it's not a bad car at all, and this will probably count, so this will count as 511, and then the next road across the street, I don't know why I didn't stop and get that board, but this road should count as 512, and then from there, I'm gonna go to the map, and then see what other roads we have to discover next, because we're so close now that we, like I said, we could probably, we probably at least come close to getting all of that done in like a few minutes, I, 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 I imagine. So, let's turn off everything. Let's see, go back, let's turn off every single thing, and see, ah, I knew the quarry was going to be one of the spots. Yeah, the quarry, the quarry is a weird place. The quarry is a really weird place because... There's so so many little miniature roads inside the quarry that it's hard to keep up and keep track of, like, which ones are which. You know what I mean? Like, it's hard to keep up and keep track of, like, which ones you, of all you've driven on and which ones you still have yet to drive on. So, I'm hopefully going to finish everything in the quarry real quick. And then once we finish everything in the quarry, we won't have to be, we won't have to be concerned about, uh, about coming back here to find that one last little inch of road that we missed, you know what I mean? Because that's always super frustrating. There's 513 out of 531. Whoa. Now we'll get this little edge right here. Five. Okay, so that got us up to 516. See how, see how many, like, little tiny roads there are? There's 517, and now we just have to go down just a little bit to get 518. And from there, I think we're done with the quarry. I don't think we have to do any more in the quarry. So there's all these little, like, weird, 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 uh, like, hidden, you know, specks of road. And, oh! Oh, God. I was gonna say, that that wasn't the most brilliant... Uh, whoa! I did not think we were gonna respawn up here. I am gonna do a burnout. Or not. I must be on race tires, because this car does not want to do a burnout at all. What I do want to do, though, is go all the way up this one, and then head straight for the other one and hit it as a ramp, if I can. I don't know if, I don't know if it'll let me. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't know if it'll let me. Wow, I'm surprised we didn't bottom out the car. I'm, I'm actually really surprised we didn't bottom out the car. But, let's see if the game is willing to let us have a little bit of fun with this. Sort of. Sort of. Yeah, sort of. Uh, okay. Flight of the Valkyrie completed. Okay. I mean, we're also, we're also mudding in an M2. That seems so wrong. 
That seems... Oh, God. I mean, we're partially... Well... I mean, at least we're driving it about the same as the way Alex drives his cars. <laughs> oh my god, I'm not picking at him, but to be fair, it's like... I mean, he did do those couple of videos where he took the Huracan, like, deep in the mud or something. It wasn't, well, wasn't really deep in the mud, but it was, like, deep enough that it was partially covered. So, let's go ahead now and see where else we have to look for... Ro Aha! There's one right there. Right there. I guarantee you, now that we're at like 518 out of 536, I guarantee you that the rest of these are all going to be like stupidly small little squiggles of road. Like that for some reason have never been driven on. Well, obviously I've never done this drift zone. Not really like, I mean, I'm here in a decent car for it, but I didn't have any run up or speed at all. Like none whatsoever. This car is really fun to slide around, though. Like, even on the dirt, it's fun. I wish that, like, this section of road was paved. And that's what we're getting in Fortune Island. Like, dude, that's one of the reasons why Fortune Island is so exciting. Because we're getting stuff like this, but paved. And to be fair, we did 51.5 without any sort of run-up or knowledge of that drift zone. So, not terrible. All right. Now, we've got that explored. What else? Again, it's going to be these tiny little specks that we're going to have to look around for and be really, really observant about. Hmm. I don't see any up here. I don't see any up here. All of these look good. Oh, gosh. This is where it's going to get, like, frustrating. The Oh! Found one. We'll get that one out of the way real quick. I'm just trying to think where I'm going to find, like, you know, the remaining, what is it, like, 18 roads that we haven't discovered yet. Like, that's so weird. Like, 18 roads that we haven't discovered yet. And where are we going to find them, you know? Like, where the hell are they? Okay, 519. 519. So, going forward from that. God, there's got to be just these tiny little stretches somewhere. Everything around here, around by the festival, seems to have been explored. What about... No way. See, I told you, that hasn't been explored. That tiny little speck. That tiny little speck. That is, that's the type of stuff... That is going to, you know, prevent you from finding all... Well, not necessarily prevent you, but that's what's going to basically, like... Basically, like, be the number one frustration. So there's 520. God. This is so freaking, like... It, it's it's so... It's, it's partially mind-numbing to find all these roads, but at the same time, I mean, I'm sure it'll be rewarding when we do find them all. But these all seem to be discovered. So we're not... Going over here by Bamberg Castle. They Oh! Well, damn. There's one. And it's weird, because I know I keep saying I don't know where the rest of these roads are going to be, but every time I say that, I find another road, and I don't know why I just happen to find another road. I just do. Well, 521. Well, I don't know which one the, like, 521st was. Yo, this is awesome! I had no idea this freaking paved road was back here. Holy crap, this is legit. This is so awesome. This is so cool. God, if you haven't come back here to drift this, you absolutely have to. Very little traffic, just super open, nice little drift road. That's awesome. God, if you haven't if you haven't messed around with that road, dude, you have to. I'm going to run it again just because it's just because it's a blast. Come on. There we go. Little transition under the e-brake. Come on. There we go. Right out fourth gear. Road gets a little covered in leaves cuz it's autumn. 
God, that provides for some amazing pictures, though. I love that road, dude. That's awesome. That's absolutely incredible. We, we need more roads like that. And that's, hopefully, that's exactly what Fortune Island is going to be. Aha! Found another one. I always, like, I'm always like, yeah, I don't know where the rest of these roads are. And you find another one. You immediately find another freaking road. I don't get it. I mean, I gotta say, though, what a fun car to find these roads in. The, the M2, the M2 is a great little car, and it's kind of a, it's, it's just kind of a cool little jack-of-all-trades. Like, you could build it for grip if you want, or you can turn it into a fun little drift car. 523. I love this little section. It's just like, it's just like that one other section that we looked at previously, but, well, it's not just like it, but it's very similar. God, it's so much fun. These little tiny back roads. I love them. Absolutely love them. You think they're going to be dirt, but they're not. So there's that. Now it gets tricky. Now it gets quite tricky. Because... Hmm. 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 I still have so many more to find. And that's the scary part. Like, that that's... That's the scary part, is that I have so many more roads to find. And, like, really, like, in all reality, it's not that that many, but it's still enough to make you go, uh, how the hell are there that many left? You know what I mean? Like, how are there that many left that I haven't messed with yet? You know what I mean? Because there's so many that you've already driven on. That it just doesn't feel, it just doesn't feel like there's that many more to find. And yet, and yet, there is. In fact, hmm, God, I'm not sure. This is definitely where it starts to get down to the point of like, okay, I don't know what I'm looking for. You know what I mean? Like, Previous, oh, damn. Well, found quite a few options right here. I bet you there's going to be somebody that's going to, like, find a bunch that I didn't see. Like, they're going to be watching the video, and they're going to see them on screen. They're going to be like, uh, I, I, that, did you missed, like, ten. You know what I mean? Like, they're going to be like, uh, bro, you missed, like, ten. This is how you drive a rear-wheel drive car on dirt. You just lay on it and eventually get where you're going. I do think, though, that... Oh, wow. This gets really steep and sketchy. Really steep and, like, slick. Really slippery. Re Whoa! Look at that. That's badass. Hell of a driveway, though. Like, I don't know if I'd, I would want that driveway. Like, damn, dude. There's 524. 524. All right. We're getting there now. Or at least starting to. Let's, let's go in up here. Because then we can come down. And we'll get all of the roads from that. Well, we'll get this full section discovered from... Are, are you serious? It always seems to want to spawn me in the opposite direction of the way I need to be going. And I don't know if that's just a, like, a Forza thing or what, but that's just what it seems to like to do. So that's, that seems to be what it does. And, ooh, riding the e-brake down the hill. Oh, boy. Ooh. That was, that was sketch. Close. But a sketch. <laughs> little transition. Oh, little little grass mowing. I mean, I guarantee you that splitter's low enough to mow the grass. Should have another little road discovered here in just a second. God, there's so many like little trails back here that I never knew existed. This is so awesome. Like. Dude, I, 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 oh, I need to bring an off-roader back here. I genuinely need to bring some of my off-roaders back here and go off-roading. Like, okay, 525. 525. We are, ge we are getting there. We have proper progress now. 
proper progress. The only thing now is the fact that the more roads we find, the more difficult it's going to be to find the rest of them. And that doesn't seem like it would be true, but it is completely 100% true. Completely 100% true. Because the more roads you find, the more you're like, oh yeah, I'm, I, oh, aha, found a little culprit up here. That one needs to be taken care of. This is why, this is why it's a good idea to take care of all those tiny little loose end roads whenever you pass them and not just drive past them like I've been doing ever since I started playing the game. So, like, keep up with that, like, with that stuff, guys. Like, it, trust me, it pays off. 526, well, we had already, wait. Oh. Oh, wait. For, 531 roads. God, for some reason... Okay, so my math was off. I thought there was going to be like 536, so we're so close. We have four more roads. We have four more roads. And that's it. Oh my god. We are like right on the... Basically right on the edge of finding every single road. That's awesome. That is... That's like... I mean, it's huge. At least like for me, that's huge. Um, oh god, there's so many, so many little places that I'm trying not to skim over. Hmm. Aha, yeah, we've got that, and we've got that. Those, dude, like, that's borderline mean, just to make those roads. That's so borderline rude. It's like, really, guys? Really? Really? Okay, so... I'm going to very slowly, systematically go, aha! There's always going to be that one little one that if you go, if you pan over slowly and carefully, that you will find, you will find a road that you still have yet to discover. Like, and I know there's going to be people that are going to be like, no, like, I can't find any roads anywhere. Dude, dude, trust me. There are roads out there to be found, 100%. Five twenty-eight. Five twenty-eight. Dude. Dude. This is this is getting insane now. Like, I'm getting super excited now because I, I can't wait to get all of these unlocked. Just trying to be super careful about aha! There's one. You have to look down at every single little tiny detail. Every single little tiny detail counts because then once you do, once you do, you'll have it. Wait, 529. Did I just get that? Did I, did I seriously just get that? Oh my God. I just did. Yeah, I just, I just did. I just got that. I can't believe I just got that, but I just got that. Okay. So from there... We are going to continue looking very carefully and slowly for... Whoa! There's one big one right here. Huge one. That's like... That's... That's... That's pretty bad that we missed that. I did not expect to miss that. Like... I... Wow. I didn't expect to miss that at all. I was not thinking about coming up this way at... And it's funny because, like, this is near the quarry. And so I should have noticed this, like, closer to the beginning of the video. Almost there. One more road. One more road. What a freaking feeling, dude. One more road. One more road. Okay. Where should I look for this last road? Gonna look slowly and carefully and systematically too, because I don't wanna like. Okay, that's been explored. I don't wanna like keep going over areas that I've been over before. Is that like a missing section of road, or is it like. Just. Or does it just look that way? I feel like it just looks that way. We'll come back to that if we need to, but I don't think that's the one. Yeah, I genuinely don't think that's the one. Let's see. The Adventure Park is fully discovered. 
What else? Is there anything else that's not fully discovered around here? Going slowly around the outskirts of the map, very slowly. There's this little lip right here, then that's been discovered. Hmm. Mm. Hmm. Come on. Oh my gosh. I feel like it, there's a good chance it could be around one of the playground areas. But at the same time, I also feel like the playground areas are probably, like, not where I should be focusing because they're probably, like, I've probably spent enough time around them already that there's really not much left to see um, or not much left to unlock in the way of roads. So, God, this has got to be just a speck somewhere. Just be that one last little speck that hasn't been driven on. One last little speck. I mean, it's literally exciting and frustrating all at the same time. Like, all at the same time. Because you're super excited because you've only got one more road to find. But you're also really frustrated because you haven't found it yet. <laughs> you're, like, really frustrated because you haven't found it yet. And, oh my god, I will... You know what? You know what? I'm going to dive into this map and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to catch back up with you guys when I find this final road. Well, guys, I think I found it. I'm pretty sure I found it. We're about to hit that last road in Horizon 4, and I am so excited. So excited. I don't know why I never went... Yes, this is it. I, I don't know why I never went all the way back here before, but my God, this is it. Holy crap. And... Boom! Boom, boom, 531 out of 531. That is every single road in Forza Horizon 4 finally unlocked. I, I, I mean, I know the game's not doing anything crazy or anything, but to be fair, like, now we can legitimately say every single road on this entire map we have driven. And that's, I mean, I consider that an achievement. I, I feel like that that's an achievement, at least like to me it is. But yeah, I had an absolute blast doing this. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed following along for my last few roads. Um, I know this was a bit of a weird Let's Play episode. Um, normally my Let's Play episodes are um, based on getting through the campaign and not, you know, based on discovery. But I, I figured since I was so close to getting all these roads um, unlocked that I figured I would, um, I would go ahead and take you guys along for the ride. And here we are um, unlocking every single road. So again, hope you all enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time. Talk to y'all later.